Okay, now we've been working towards getting uh, to do the really cool stuff in, in Google Docs, and that is when you can share your document with somebody else. So let's say you and another person are working on this report together. Okay, you've both been assigned this same report, and you, you're going to create one document, or you and eight other people. It doesn't matter how many people there are. The rules all kind of are, are the same. So first of all, I'm going to share this with that other person, okay? So I'm going to go up here to this big blue share button, and it's going to load this up, and it's like, who do you want to share this with? Well, I'm going to share it with myself, but I'm going to share it with my other account. So this is my uh, personal account. So I'm going to share that um, with them. And here are their choices. They could, you could have them so they could comment or only view, or they can edit it. Now, if you're working on it together, you're, you're going to allow that other person to edit it. Okay. So I'm just going to leave it on edit, and I'm going to go ahead and send that note. And it's just saying, hey, this person is not at your same school. Are you sure you want to share it with this person? And in my case, I do because I'm just doing a demo for you. But normally, you'll just be sharing it with just students at your school. Maybe when you get into middle school and high school, you might share it with a student in another school in another country. But for right now, I'm like, yeah, I just want to do that. Okay. So now I've shared it with that other person. And what's really cool is you can insert comma comments here. Like I can select this photo here. Sorry, I can just uh, select surface or something. Oops, see, there, my invitation's already come in there. Just go away. There we go. Okay, so let's say I'm concerned about this photo here. So I'm just going to select a word really close to that photo, and I'm going to tap on the uh, open comment here, and I'm going to comment, and it's going to be connected to that thing there. I'm going to say, um, uh, do you like this photo? Okay. So I'm just making some comments in our thing and okay I'm going to do this one here we're going to talk to this person again another comment here make a comment um, since this is your section could you make each one in red comment. Okay. So we've got a couple of comments there. So now if I go over and I become me in the other one here, so if I just go back to Google, and I log out of, I log in as me in my other account here. Wait till you see this. It's awesome. Okay. And I go into Docs. In my Google Drive. And I go to documents that are shared with me. And you can see this volcano report shared by this guy named Brad Flickinger. Now, of course, it's a little confusing because I'm the same person, but you get what I'm saying. So I open it up and let's say I'm in a whole other part of town or whatever. I'm on my computer opening this up and, and I can scroll through this and I can see the comments made by my partner in crime. Okay, so you can see my comment is right here since you've got this section, so uh, uh, that person's talking to me, so I'm just gonna go ahead and change these to red because they asked me to change those to red and I agree with it. Don't ever, this is the biggest rule about sharing, don't change someone else's work. Like if you're not in charge of it, don't mess around with it. You can ask the person to do it, ask them what they think about it, but don't just go in and delete someone's work or change someone's work, okay? That's just not cool. And, and it's great. So then I can say this is resolved. So I just tap on resolve. Now it goes away. Okay. So that's kind of cool about that. I see my other one about this, this lava one here. We must not have saved it because it's not showing up here. So anyway, we must not have pressed the little blue comment button because it didn't show up. So make sure to double check on your comments to make sure that they're working good. So essentially that's how you're sharing the document. And you can see up here that it's being shared between you and me. And you can share in real time. Like you can see the other person working while you're working if you both are logged in at the same time. Really cool stuff. But again, only work on those sections that um, you've been assigned. If you've not been assigned section, don't drive yourself crazy with you and your partner or you and other people. Then someone is the leader. Someone creates the first document, okay? So one person is the leader. They make the first document. Then they invite the other people into that document. Whoever that leader is, you also make the assignments. So at the first of the report, you might want to say something like, you know, uh, I could just write in my name. I could say, uh, Timmy, uh, do the ac activities, you know, paragraph. 
and you know, so Timmy knows that uh, that I'm talking to him. Actually, I shouldn't do it there. I should just do it in comments right here. I could just select the title and uh, make a comment here. Oh, there we go. There's the other one. So comment, and I'll say Timmy, please do the activities paragraph. Okay, so that, Timmy's going to see it when they open up their thing. Okay, so just comment on that. That's what we forgot to do before is press that little blue button, and now it's locked into there. Okay, so that is essentially how to share a document and how to work with comments, okay?